the world to me to get the story out about my papa because uh, he he was really a special person. He was a huge uh, Georgia Tech fan, and what was funny about that was he never really tried to get me to be a Georgia Tech fan. You know, he was just happy that I liked football. Um, and I found out back in February that he used to usher um, at the Georgia Tech games as a part of Boy Scouts. The hope was is that I would get to spend one more Thanksgiving with my papa because um, I find that it doesn't matter what it is, we all have that person that brings us into whatever it is we, we're really passionate about. And for me, when it comes to football, my papa brought me into that. I knew that you know the Syracuse game would be would be special, you know, just to be able to get down here and and see a game. It was a crazy trip. Uh, we went from Messina to I think it was like 160 miles down to Syracuse, and then we got on the plane in Syracuse, went to Baltimore, and uh, then we ended up going to Atlanta from Baltimore. We made it to Bobby Dodd. I would say it was uh, it was everything and more. I've never seen a game at Bobby Dodd. I, I always love when Georgia Tech gets the opportunity to play at night because I think one of the biggest things about this stadium is the skyline behind it. I was impressed by how, like on television, Bobby Dodd looks massive. And obviously when you're standing next to it, Bobby Dodd looks massive. But when you're sitting in your seats, there's like no bad seat in this place. Um, and I was really impressed by that because you, you do feel like you are so close to the action. My papa always had, you know, great sayings and uh, was always great about, uh, you know, encouraging people. And one of the things my papa would always tell me is that every day is an opportunity to make your life a little bit better and the lives of those you love a little bit better. And so every day when you wake up, you got to take that opportunity to do that.